Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so I haven't filmed in a while. I'm sorry. I know I say that probably on every single video. Like, sorry I haven't filmed. Sorry I haven't been on YouTube. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I'm terrible. Yeah, I just, I've been really busy. I've been, everybody says that. I've been so busy. Like, everybody's busy, but... I, I just got done moving, so I actually have my own beauty room now. So I actually have a room that I can, like, film in and all that good shit. And I actually have room for, like, my stuff. Like, I did not have room for my stuff before, like, at all. I was, like, sitting on the edge of my bed. I was, like, like, my, my desk and everything was in our bedroom. So, like, I basically took over our bedroom and, like, we couldn't just have it be, like, our bedroom. It was literally, it was my studio slash office slash bedroom uh, i will try to post more to um oops to youtube but i do prefer instagram i just I, I have a bigger following on there and i just i i don't know i love making instagram videos i love my instagram videos so i just i don't know i will try to post more to youtube it's not like i don't like youtube i just like i don't know i enjoy instagram like a lot more i guess so, and I do seem to get more interactions with brands and stuff through my um, Instagram and all that. All that aside, um, let's go ahead and jump into this video. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and also hit that little notification bell. And if you aren't following me on Instagram, please go follow me on Instagram. It's Taya the Slaya XO. Um, I know I just like was like, oh no, you know, I don't really post on YouTube, but follow me anyway. <laughs> so today's video is kind of random. It's not makeup, but I kind of wanted, you know, my channel to be, you know, not just makeup. It's beauty related. But I've done hair stuff like in the past too. Um, so this, I was at Sally's and I seen they had like a 40% off sale. And this was sitting like on the front counter. So... I seen it and I was like, what is that freaking contraption? Like, what is that thing? It was 40% off. So it was like $83 and then like 40% off of that or whatever. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy it and I'm going to try it. And I was like, I'm going to try it on YouTube. So let's see. Like, I was like, I want to give this a go. I don't even have it open. It's like still has like the plastic on. Oh. So, yeah, obviously, so you guys literally know, like, I have not used this thing. I haven't tried it. Like, I don't know anything about it. Um, I have tried, like, one of those curl genius things in the past that, like, you stick your hair in it and it curls it. Um, it was okay. Like, I didn't have any, like, real issues with it. It was just, like, for my extensions, like, I couldn't really use it. It's kind of like my hair was too long. I had to do pieces, like, this big. Um, but I'm not doing that with this today. So... Like, I personally, I just felt like it was easier for me to curl my hair with a curling iron, so that's why I don't have one of those. This Titanium Pro Automatic Curler thing from Ion at Sally Beauty. This is a Sally Beauty brand, like, owned brand, so this isn't, like, you know, hot tools or anything. What it claims to do is it creates curls at the push of a button. It says automatically creates effortless and silky smooth curls in just seconds. Smart sensors with easy-to-use precise control. And then customizable curl direction, temperature, and curl pattern. Oh, that seems really freaking high tech. Like, that sounds like real fancy. So, I don't know. I don't know if I'll be able to figure this out. Look at this picture, like, right here showing. Like, it goes, like, you put your hair in it and it just kind of, like, curls it. So, I'm, gonna ha I'm definitely going to need the instructions for this thing because I'll probably fuck it up somehow. So, it does show that you, ha you have left, right, and then alternating curl things and then you can do different curl patterns so you can do you change the temperature setting and the time setting so you can have loose natural looking and tight I prefer loose curls but actually for this video I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try them all and see if there's really a difference yeah create beautiful curls with minimum effort I like that so oh what is this fancy thing all right Oh my god, it's like, so it has like this like, clamp thing to like open and close it there. You can see it from the side. Oh my god, this is weird! Alright, well, we better plug it in. I should like maybe get the instructions out right away so I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I just dropped it. I caught it with my thick thighs. Thick thighs save lives and apparently curling iron contraptions. 
just beeped at me. Okay, so that's a little dangerous, I think. Um, so I don't really like that. I don't think this is like good for like kids or anything. Or, like, I feel like it'd be really easy to touch that. It does say right on the top, high temp, do not touch. Uh, but it's kind of just like out and exposed right there. So I don't, like, I'm so stupid. Like, I literally want to touch it. <laughs> okay, we better follow the instructions to like a T or else this is not going to go over well. It says you can adjust the temperature, but it doesn't like say, oh, I'm dumb. It's on the bottom. Look at that. It's on the bottom. It says off. Oh, it's not even heating up. I'm like sitting here like, oh, this is going to get hot. It's not even on. So we'll turn, hit the power button. It automatically turned on. I pressed and held the power button. It automatically turned on to 410. The curl direction is showing alternating. So that's just auto. So then it'll like just do, I think we should just do auto. I don't really want to like alternate them. Um, okay, I'm figuring this out. Okay, so this button on top, this M button right here, you use that to like use the to do the settings okay so like when you click it it highlights something else like it'll so like it's so that's to change the curl pattern and then you use these to change like the curl pattern oh maybe not oh yeah that is okay and then to change the temperature and then also the tightness of the curl I believe the curl time so it'll be 8 seconds 10 seconds 12 seconds or 14 seconds so I think we should, should we just leave it at 12? I think that's what it was on. It just automatically went to 12. So 8 or 10 is loose curls, 12 is natural looking curls, and then 14 is tight curls. Why don't we try the loose curls for starters? We'll try 8 and we'll start with that. And we are, I'm just going to do the alternating curl patterns. Maybe I should change my shirt for this to like a white shirt so you guys can like see better. Like the curls because my shirt's black. I'm just going to... I'm just gonna strip down right in front of you here. Yeah, I can't see nothing. Ah, oh, she's naked. Yeah, I'm not wearing a bra either. Oh, cause I'm at home and I don't give a shit. God, you guys are gonna see that I straightened my hair in the front but not in the back because I'm doing videos and not going anywhere today. <laughs> in the initial operation, it is recommended to use hair sectioning accessory. Hair sectioning accessory? I didn't see that in the box. Oh. Yeah, it's in there. This thing is to section our hair. I don't understand. Holy smokes, this is like freaking high tech. Oh my God, look at that. Some breakage that I have. Hair length less than 11 inches. You wanna use the .20 side. There is no .20 side. Five millimeter, oh, okay. I wanna use the five millimeter if my hair is 11.8 inches less than I think this is long I think my hair is longer than that so I think I have I definitely have like a foot I think I don't understand how this thing is supposed to like section your hair though because these are like really tiny little holes and if like your hair is supposed to like fit in there and that's the amount of hair you're supposed to use here let's, let's just go over here wrong end that's a really tiny curl if that's the amount that I'm supposed to use and in the picture it kind of is showing really tiny strands okay well I'll just shove my hair in this thing and hope for the best and hopefully I don't lose a chunk this is a pretty small chunk of hair like I don't think that's a lot so all right so hold that, turn it on. Use thumb and forefinger to press the keys on both sides of the machine to open the curl. Make sure the hair is dry and combed through before curling, section hair, then insert hair into the curl chamber. The curl chamber. God, I'm afraid I'm gonna burn myself. Oh, it is getting hot. I just felt the heat come off. So I'm supposed to shove my hair. Oh God, it's something's moving in there oh my god this is weird look at this okay let's just I don't know oh. yo 
it just took my hair in there. Okay. It's beeping. Okay, I think it'll release it when it's ready. Do I let... Do I let go? Do I release the... Oh, yep. I, I, oh. oh, it's curled! Oh my god! It's curled! That's cool! Okay, so that's not really a... I don't think that's really like a loose curl though. Like that's a pretty pretty tight curl. So I'm kind of curious what a bigger curl looks like. Or like the what the um longer ones end up being. So I think we'll turn it up. Let's let's crank this bad boy up to the 12. We're just gonna skip the 10 and go right up to the 12. So there's curl number one. I'm gonna take a <coughs> Fuck. I'm gonna take a little bit bigger of a section this time and see how it goes. All right. Oh, it got it. It got it. It was a bigger chunk. All right. She's counting. It's yelling at me. Okay. Release. It looks weird. It's beeping at me again. There's no hair in there, genius. Uh, it's okay. Like this isn't like beautiful, but it's. It. I don't think it's any tighter than the other one. So I think that is a load of malarkey. I think they're all the same size because they pretty much look the same to me. But hey, it's actually it's really nice. It's a really nice curl. Like, I feel like I should like pull them, pull them down. I don't really think the temperature is really gonna make a difference with the tightness. I feel like that's gonna be just more of like how resistant your hair is to curling. I say we keep going. I should attempt to do my whole head. I'm gonna turn it up to 14 and do one more strand and see if we notice the difference because honestly, to me right now, these two curls look the same. Like they just look the same to me. Let's do. This chunk right here. Oh shit. You guys, my hair is stuck. It's beeping at me. It keeps saying error. I don't even know what piece that was. This ugly thing right here. You look at it. Oh my god, it has like some nasty kinks in it. Well, it was like delayed. Like it sucked the hair and then I dropped it and then it like wasn't done. So like, shut up. I don't know if I want to put it back in my fucking head. Oh my god, that was scary. Literally, my heart was like, <gasps> my head was stuck to it. Oh. Okay, that didn't happen with that curl genius thing that I tried because that one actually like spit the hair back out. This motherfucker did not spit the hair out. It just said error and then like sat there with your hair like burning inside. Am I stupid for trying this again? Like I feel like I'm stupid for just sticking my head back in this thing. It didn't do anything. I like unclamped it and then it like did its little spinny trick. Okay, got another one. Yeah, I don't, um, okay, nice pretty curl, but it's not like any tighter, so I don't really think I need to have it on 14 seconds. I feel like that's just like too much. There's no hair in there, stop beeping. God, it's annoying. Tell me to release the hair and then there's no hair in it. Okay, well, I don't know. I don't really want to do my whole head. This thing's kind of like, it's kind of annoying to hold and it's, uh, ripped some of my hair out. Let me put it down to eight seconds. 410 is definitely fucking hot enough though because I don't even put my flat iron on that high. I, I usually have it like on like 310 or any, or something like that and it's still like my hair is really thick and it still does the job so. Okay I'll try another one but it, the things like tell me to do really tiny pieces of hair and I'm just like I don't fucking have time for that like I don't like I don't want like tight little curls anyway like I want like big loose fluffy curls. Oh 
God, I can't even like, I gotta like twist it around or else I won't get the hair in. Oh, there I got it. I like don't even wanna finish my head because this is like really dumb. Like it's doing it, but like honestly, I would still rather just like use a curling iron. Yeah. So, I mean, it's making some really pretty curls. I'm sorry, you can't like hardly see them because my hair is jet black, but. <clears throat> I don't really like it. Like, I don't like this thing. You can't even get that much hair in it. Fuck. God damn it. Shit. Maybe I'm stupid, maybe I can't like figure this thing out, but uh, it's gonna be a no for me. <laughs> I don't even wanna like finish doing my hair, like that's gonna take forever, like I have so much hair left to curl, like, like I have this entire, like all that, yeah. Wow, that thing's really disappointing. God, kinda like, do you know what the shape kinda reminds me of? If you've ever seen the show, Everybody Loves Raymond. God, my hair is like caught in there. You can see chunks of my hair inside there. If you've ever seen the show, Everybody Loves Raymond, um, there's this episode where his mom makes this sculpture, and I'm going to insert the picture in here so you guys can see it. <laughs> but everybody thinks it looks like a fucking vagina. That's what this reminds me of. It looks like that sculpture. <laughs> Yeah, a bunch of my hair is inside there because it ripped it out. This fucking contraption, Sally, send it back. I don't like it. Don't waste your money, guys. Just get a fucking curling iron. Now I'm gonna have like, I'm just gonna try and like straighten these curls or I'm just gonna curl my hair with a wand. Um, which if you guys want a good wand from Sally Beauty, um, this GVP titanium curl wand is really good. Feel free to go pick up one of these bad boys cause I can like curl my hair like a motherfucker with this thing. So I'm gonna unplug this thing that just ripped my hair out. Yeah, I'm gonna curl the rest of my hair with it I guess and then make some more Instagram videos. That was a fail, so. Yeah, but I mean if you wanna try it yourself, maybe you guys think I'm stupid and I don't know how to use it, which could definitely be the case, but I don't think I don't think this one's operator error. I think this one is just a weird fucking vagina shaped contraption that you like suck your hair in and it rips it out. So don't know what I'm gonna do with this little thing. Okay, I'm done with this video. Hope you guys liked it. Hope it saved you some money if you were thinking about buying that thing. Sorry, Sally Beauty. Hard pets. All right, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, again, if you want to see more videos like this, leave me a comment and let me know. Um, also, like and subscribe, and I will hopefully see you guys in my next video.